Hey YouTube, it's AMG Halo Freak. This is my tutorial on how to paint a Wii remote. Um, all you're gonna need is the case. Forget about this for a while. Uh, I'm not gonna teach you how to show the how to paint these. I I don't know how in the first place. Um, all you're gonna need for now is just the front piece. Okay. So you see that this little uh, clear piece is was right in here it it just basically covers up the LEDs you're just gonna take a little screwdriver push it through and it comes right out as you can see uh, it comes it goes back in really easy okay so that's ready for painting okay this you just pulled this off you see this right here uh, it's the case for, I mean, it's the cover for the batteries. Uh, if you have a rechargeable battery pack, you can... I, uh, I don't know how to paint that, but... You can certainly paint that, but... Uh, so, I, I'd say that these don't need to be painted. They're just too small for the tape to hold onto. You want to take about three inches of tape. You're going to want to place it on here, like this. Push down. You want to keep that little tab covered and then just like that and then just you can just rip it off and then you see these sides just squeeze it together and then if you want extra reinforcement just go ahead and put another piece of tape like this and it's done but it's mostly just to keep this from uh, getting all stuck when it gets into the controller that's all you need to do uh, you can see over here, that's the way they're going to be set down when you're going to paint them. The I'd say about this is the hardest part. The B button hardly even moves, so just like, you can get maybe an inch or two. Well, you see that little space at the top? That space right there, you can just go around the whole edge with that amount of tape, and you'll be good. Uh, it, there's more to the B button than just that. Take about three inches of tape, cut it, and then just about the same amount of line at the top. You just want to do that, and then smoothen it out, and just do that. I'm going to do the whole thing for a while. When prepping this, you want to wash every single little piece, except for the buttons. Well, every piece that you're going to paint with Dawn dish soap and some warm water. Uh, Dawn dish soap works the best. Uh, bargain brand Dawn dish soap, whatever. Uh, and then this part, you're gonna want to take your tape and just put it over that and then fold it like that. And then just push it down. And then, see, it fits. Uh, that's ready. Now, I'd say this is about the hardest part. Um, and then you just you get about just enough to cover up the bottom of the controller. Uh, I have some dead batteries here. I'm just going to insert them into here so it's like got something to hold on to. Just insert them. I don't really care if these get tape on them. I mean uh, paint on them. So just like this. And grab the tape. Set it on top. And well, that's about that's too little tape, but like from the side, just like this, set it down, and push it all the way over. You can also attach it to the batteries. See, it's like that. Then you you just want to cover that up. You want to cover everything up. That's ready for painting. Um, never ever paint this little black piece or whatever it is. Uh, because then it won't let you use this, and you won't be able to use the controller. Uh, this is the D-pad after it's been prepped. Uh, here. I'm just going to take this off for now. Okay. As you can see, there's just these little squares of tape. What you want to do, you just, you just want to take some tape, cut it like a square, and then set it into these corners 
and just try and flatten it down as much and then get some just get a little longer piece of tape and then set it right there in that so that you have that sort of shape on both sides this and then you're ready to go uh, when you set it onto the where you're going to be painting it you can just push it down and it'll stick so that's it um i'm not going to show you how to paint these buttons because they're just way too hard to paint and just better to leave them alone all right uh thanks uh i'll i'll make a video in a few minutes or well i'll post a video in a little bit that'll show you well wait i still have something else to show you okay if you want to give it a design you just want to roughly put it together like so just grab a long piece of tape really long cut it and then like if you want to keep the Wii just put the tape over the Wii sign and then just go around and like this see ta-da rip that's part of your design uh, I usually like just to do little zigzags or whatever you can do that uh, just go around it and then when you're ready to paint just grab your knife cut it on all sides be careful try not to cut yourself and see it just comes clean off it it really works uh, it gives you a good design so thanks for watching uh, subscribe after about a hundred subscribers I'll probably post my face uh, in a video but I'm not gonna tell you guys which one thanks